So today we're having some fun. We've been testing all week. Connor's been in town filming the testing. Today we're gonna shoot the inside of a steel safe. It's a 17 gauge piece of steel that's a divider. We're gonna try to shoot it 80 to 100 times. We don't know, but we've got a, an Apollo arrow tipped with an Evolution broadhead. So we're gonna put this thing through its paces, see how many times that we shoot it before any real damage happens to it. But there is gonna be a shot somewhere inside of this video, and if it gets made, you guys are gonna be able to take a big discount on serious archery products. So let's uh, strap in and stay tuned. Or the stouter it stays, the I think we need to put just a few more. And today we're going to have a little bit of fun. Tyler's here with me. Connor came into town, and we had some extra time on our hands after doing some other testing. We got a piece of a divider from a steel um, gun cabinet. So we're gonna just see how many times we can put an arrow through it with a broadhead before either the broadhead tip rolls or the arrow breaks. So we're gonna see how many we get. I have a feeling it's gonna be a little loud. This is our new space. It's not quite built out yet. So we got the place to come in and play. They're doing some construction in the background there. So if you hear that, that's what it's gonna be. But this is a big open space. I think it's gonna be loud. We are at about eight yards. Nine yards. Well, here's one. Let's see what happened. We're gonna have to do this every time. <laughs> Nothing. That's predicted. I think because nothing happened to it, we probably ought to shoot like five times and then come take a look at it each time after five because there's not, there's not even tip damage, there's, there's not even any edge damage to the blade, so. Hold it up here, let me see it again. Sweet. All right, Tyler, you're up. All right. There's the blade in case anybody was wondering. And Arrow did break a knock on that one. Put a new knock in it and we'll go back to town. One thing I didn't talk about before is after each shot, you're not seeing us do it, but we're flexing this arrow just to make sure we don't hear anything. You'll hear some cracking or sound like little fibers breaking if you have a, a cracked arrow, but we're gonna get a new knock put in here. Do it again. That, that was our 11th shot. So we said we were gonna show you every five, but it's getting kind of boring because it's like the definition of insanity. We keep doing the same thing and nothing's changing. And we didn't want to bore you. There we go. So after 11 shots, we still don't have edge chatter. Now it is dull as a butter knife, but it's been through 17 gauge steel. Uh, that's the 11th time. The arrow, obviously you can see nothing happened to the arrow. We did replace a knock, you guys saw we blew a knock out. That's been it. A lot of times these knocks on these hard impacts, you're gonna see there's just a lot of air pressure in here. And if it doesn't get released out the, out the end, you'll start seeing knock damage and you really have to check at that point to make sure that you don't have any kind of uh, damage to the back end because a lot of arrows that aren't serious they'll have the issue of they'll have some splintering at the back but but new knock that's a, probably our sixth shot with it no problem so let's do another 10 and we'll, we'll check it out again
There we go. Okay. Make me sweat on that one. All right. Here's our broadhead. We're starting to lose a little bit of Cerakote, which is the ceramic coating on it. But that's our 20th shot through that steel. Arrow seems to be still perfect. Twenty shots. All we've done so far is replace one knock. Not bad. All right. See, this is our thirtieth shot. I might feel the slightest, so we're right there, maybe the slightest burr right there, but I mean, I can't, you might be able to get it with paper, but still, look at the tip. They'll say it's just the tip. There's not even any roll in the tip. Arrow. Same arrow. Apollo. So. You guys got me for 10 more, then Tyler's going to have to take over at some point. <laughs> All right, here's number 40. There's the broadhead. We're starting to get a little bit of chatter on one edge, and I think that's where that burr I said was coming. I don't know, it's even hard to tell, it's so small. But uh, none on this side, maybe just a tiny bit of chatter on this side, but something that would just take the back side of a sharpening stone and be out. And then as far as the arrow goes, nothing. Show me the broad head one more time. Just put it in your hand, kind of. <sighs> Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm tapping out for a while. That was, uh, I think Tyler may have shot five and had to leave. <laughs> He's always doing that to me. But in a few minutes, uh, he'll be back over here. I'll let him shoot the next 20 or so, and then we'll finish up. Hopefully we'll get through 80. We've got two more spots that we can put 20 in. Connor, I think you should flip these around. Make them look right. And um, we'll be back here shortly. All right, let's keep going. All right, so this is number 50. Take it out. Broadhead, <sighs> tip, still fine. Getting a little edge chatter now, but I mean, for 50 shots through a steel plate, what are you gonna expect? But this S7 tool steel is just amazing. Keep going. All right, 60 shots. Let's see how she's looking. Spoiler alert, I don't think anything's changed. Okay, there's number 60. Might not be able to see it too good in the shadow there, but broadhead tip, still pointy at that tanto tip. Still got a little bit of edge rolling, but nothing you couldn't sharpen out. Nothing that's damaging the structural integrity of the head.
70 shots. Same broadhead, same arrow, same steel. Arrow and half jacket, just fine. Got some foam on there, but again, I mean, Tanto tip still 100% intact. A little bit of edge rolling and blunting, but again, this is 70 shots. It's still 100% resharpenable and reusable. No major damage. Look who's back. Tapping back in for a few more. Give Tyler's arms a bit of a rest. He made a mess of that center one, so. I'm gonna go far right. Let's look at our Tanto tip. No rolling, still sharp and pokey. Still no edge chatter on that side. And nothing really seems to have changed too much on this side, just a little bit. Cerakote's starting to rub off a little bit more now. I think, you know, just going through the target, but other than that, how about 20 more, maybe? Connor will do one, we'll make it 21 more. Okay, found a serious sticker this time. We were originally planned to shoot this 80 times, but that seems ridiculous not to go to 100 or further, so needed more space. So there we go. Let's do another 20 and see what happens. Okay, so we're gonna put a discount code in here. I'm gonna try to shoot the dead center of the serious uh, sticker down there. If I do, you guys will get a 15% off discount. Uh, I think, Connor, what's the code? STV15. STV15. There you go. Use STV15. It'll be good till the end of March on all the serious archery products. So let's see if I can get it done. Only if you hit the sticker. <laughs> Only if I hit the center of the sticker. Oh, okay. I will need an arrow. I'm really nervous. There's a lot riding on this. A lot of pressure. A lot of pressure. So scared. Pretty close. Pretty close. <laughs> that looks like a discount code to me. I, I say. That's got to be close enough. Yeah. S-A-T-V-15, right? Nope. 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 Daggone, I knew I'd get that wrong. What is it? S-T-V. S-T-V-15. S-T-V-15, I guess it. I'll put it in the... Put it in, in the, the show bottom. notes. I'll put it in the go. bottom, like right here somewhere. S-T-V-15. 82. I'm going to shoot to 85 and then Tyler's going to shoot. This one going down is going to be number 90, so I have about 10 left. Alright, show us the broadhead. Alright, good. Alright. So 
So that was shot number 90. Again, Tonto tip still intact, still got a point to it. Edges look about the same as they've probably looked to you guys for the last 20 or 30 shots. <laughs> and we were gonna make our way to 100. 91. And go down along the bottom. All right, it's gonna be the 100th shot here for the day. We've made it this far. Wouldn't it and suck if it broke on 100? <laughs> <laughs> it would suck, but after what we've seen so far, I wouldn't count on it. Yeah. That was a good sound for the last one, too. Yeah, just a bit high, but Connor can put the last one right down the Broadway. Taking out number 100. Hurry, switch it out with a good one. <laughs> In case anybody was wondering, after 100 shots, it's your Tanto tip. Still sharp. There's been no roll. This edge is good. This edge, after about 40 shots, we had just a little bit of roll in it, and it just hasn't got any worse. There's a little burr right there that we could knock off and it would still be sharp. So I'm gonna say that's a success for sure. Then here's the, the Apollo that we built. It does have our patented half jacket system in it. You know, it might be fun as we could put it on the air spinner. Yeah. You wanna try, see what happens. Let's put it over there. This is the most beautiful backdrop you guys will ever see. There we go. After 100 shots. We did break a knock somewhere around, I don't know. It was like shit. 30 or 40. Oh, I don't think it was that far, was it? No, it was like it was before first... you left. I think yeah, we were probably like there. eight or nine. Yeah. <laughs> and we replaced the knock and that's been it. I thought maybe I saw something on the back edge, but no, it's just foam. We've we've destroyed that target today. We have to buy Tyler a new target, but uh, I think we need to go one more. We always like to go one better than everybody else, so that's been shot a hundred times. I think we need to get Connor from behind the camera, pull back on one. We'll put you at five feet and shoot real close, <laughs> and let's let you let make the hundred and first shot. All right. Let's frustrate you. Let's hope I don't shoot my camera here. There you go, 101 shots, tough head broadheads, serious archery Apollo arrow, got it done. It's 100, 101 actually. I couldn't really tell. Some of these look like we shot it with a 12 gauge. <laughs> so. It's <laughs> a bit of a mangle. <laughs> Yeah, jeez.